All good. Good afternoon and welcome to the Indra Stadium for this Cinch League One match as Aloe Athletic take on Airdrionians. I'm Kieran Mooney and I'm joined by Aloe midfielder John Robertson. John, your commentary debut, you're, you're loving it, eh? Uh, absolutely. I don't, I don't know about midfielder though. I don't, I, know, I, I don't know if I've got a staple. That's, um, a, that's a good point, actually. <laughs> Mr. Versatile, joined by. Dude. Just getting yeah, the best by, this, by the skipper. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Just being, you've got, you've got high, high heights to hit. Hit with um, Senna's commentary last week. Aye, he's probably the same boys, snogs and kisses and all I that. Know. So was he getting a bit of stick for it in the dressing room? Aye, well, I never got a kiss. You I never, never got, got a kiss. So I'm a bit disappointed in that, to be honest. But you're not going to be throwing out any promises like, well, like that on air today. Depends how it goes. Let's see how it goes. Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's not make any promises just now, though. But um, tough game today. Big game today to keep my momentum after such a massive victory last last Sunday. Yeah, absolutely. I think you've you've got to follow up. Um, performances like last week and results like last week. Um, still in my mind coming today thinking that you know after we beat Falkirk here, we went to Airdrie mm-hmm. during the week um, and obviously on that occasion didn't follow up that result. Yeah. So I quite like that it's the same team. Yeah. I quite like it's a similar situation. So hopefully we can go one better this time. Yeah, we'll just, I think it's a whole new, pretty much a whole new 11 to what we started with on Wednesday. I think it's fair to say we could probably just write that one off and, and it, it's just getting momentum from, from Sunday and Wednesday's just kind of forgotten about, really. Or <laughs> yeah. Maybe not quite, but... Uh, uh, yeah, it may be easier said than done. But no, <laughs> listen, yeah, of course, uh, Gaffer made changes um, trying to use the squad. That's that's the point in a squad, isn't it? So, mm-hmm. um, and it maybe didn't they go quite... <laughs> just photo bombing. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe they didn't quite go to plan, but uh, <laughs> um, but listen, yeah, we'll move on. We'll talk about today. Um, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I think the stadium announcer is just announcing that we're going to have a minute of silence again for Walter Smith. We had one on Wednesday again, but such a fantastic legend in the game. I think he yeah, said absolutely. I think he said he was good, the referee was going to do it and the players were going to do it. Yeah, that yeah. makes sense. Absolutely so makes sense. I think one of the one things we would say about Walter, he's won so many trophies and such a legend for Scotland Rangers, everything. But one thing that kind of came across in all the all the stories was what, how much of a gentleman he was as well and how much class he had as a as a person. Yeah, absolutely. Never never actually had the pleasure, um, unfortunately. But um, um, yeah, absolutely deserves everything he's getting. Um, today and around the around the place, and here comes the visitors in fine form themselves. Three wins on the bounce for Airdrie, and I think well, I'm sure we'll talk about in the first half the, the mental game they had last Saturday. Um, it certainly took the headlines, but uh, there'll be a tricky opposition. It's someone that Aloha have get, they, they have struggled with against in the past. Like it has been, they've always been tough tough affairs. Yeah, since I've been here, definitely they've always been kind of tight, even going right down to the. The sort of semi-final playoffs in mm-hmm. the first the first season I was here. I was, I was wondering how long it would take you to drop that one. Then. I think <laughs> I think it's the last time I scored. To be fair, so <laughs> I'll do everything I can. But, but you know, even the games throughout that season with them, um, and again going back to the the game we had with them at the start of this season, tough. tight affairs, yeah. tough affairs, very different Airdrie side as well. You know, come from from then to from, now. Yeah, exactly. Um, and here is the Aloha team doing their new kind of sports science routine. A couple of changes from, from last Sunday. Ewan Henderson comes in as does um, Mohamed Niang Senna. Um, it's good to see, obviously we'll speak about Senna later, but it's good to see Henderson in because he was absolutely he was on fire when he came on last Sunday, wasn't he? Yeah, he's just he's got that natural pace and power about him which is going to cause anybody problems. Um, and hopefully he can kind of build it on his confidence on that and we'll get the best out of him if he gets you know, a run of games. Players will just line up. The minute of silence will start and finish on referee Barry Cook's whistle for Walter Smith, who sadly passed away at the start of the week.
moment of silence complete as the two captains will go up and for the coin toss as we get this game underway. And uh, we spoke we spoke about it off air. I think we knew about it, but uh, the Alwa fans will look at that team sheet and will wonder what way the defence is going to line up. And Sen has been put in. Is it your position, the left back position? You've been everywhere <laughs> else at the park, but yeah. Sen is it's a bit of a an unfamiliar one. That's like a little bit of a, a surprise to see him playing left back. Yeah, I think I think you can't argue with that. Um, as far as I know, he has played in defence, mm -hmm. uh, probably more centrally, I'd imagine. But we could see what he produces, and again, he's a big, powerful lad. He's quite good in the air, so I don't imagine he'll have too much issues with it, to be honest. Here, Jay will kick start us for the first half. No primed and ready to put the ball right on Senna, give him an early <laughs> sort of test. <laughs> there you go, good in the air, I told you. <laughs> Confident header. Early chance there for Ajid, nicks off. Of Mark Dunning now for a corner kick. And Adam Frizzle there with the, with the effort. Uh, he won't be shy after his goal against us. It was a good finish. It, well, it, it really was. And I think that's one of them you overanalyze sometimes. think mm. could we have done better, but it's a, it's, it's a really good finish <laughs> uh, on the night. Will be Kerr McEnoy to take the corner kick. He whips it in. And it's, it's good. Yeah, good hands from David Hutton. He distributes it out quickly. It's been a bit of his, a feature of puts his game to yeah. get the ball out quickly and get the ball moving, is Absolutely. that something the manager kind of presses at training and things like that? He's definitely encouraged to do it, um, and you can see why it's the first thought in Hutt's mind I think that's his natural game anyway um, is to you know do things sharp um, so I can, I, can, I can also see why it's encouraged mm -hmm. I suppose it's uh, worthwhile in the first couple of minutes to give the fans a wee update. Well, you're not in the park today, played well last Sunday, but um, up in the stands with me. <laughs> <laughs> a bit of a downgrade, <laughs> but... <laughs> uh, talk, talk so down to yourself. <laughs> uh, no, I know. If basically, since pre-season, I've been kind of nursing a, a wee groin injury. Nothing serious, but we can't quite get it to settle down. And earlier on in the week, I, I had to get an injection um, just to try and help the inflammation. And hopefully, it'll help settle it down. Um, but I've basically got a week's rest if, mm -hmm. if you want to call it that to let the injection do its work so hopefully so, yeah. nothing more serious than that and all eyes on Falkirk next Saturday that the, that the hope uh, yeah hopefully I mean again I'll just be doing my best to get back involved mm -hmm. um, at the minute I'm not so Aye, frustrating frustrating but this is this is a good second don't <laughs> don't hide behind that <laughs> Strong from many it, and it's a neat wee touch there from Stephen Boyd as well. <laughs> I think the boy McGill's just taking a. It's a big unit to come through, to come through him when I head down the back. <laughs> yeah. um, he's, a, he's an entertaining player to watch, Mendy. He, does it, he likes to do things. <laughs> I think it was, um, was it Dumbarton away that he decided to keep you up his sort of overhead kick it in his yeah. own box? He did. Yeah. Certainly unconventional sometimes. <laughs> but, uh, it's, it's definitely part of his game to be a bit kind of I don't know what the word is maybe a bit more free free reign with it but <laughs> he's, he's big he's quick he's good in the air he's got the basic attributes certainly in this country and in Britain we look for from a centre half so <laughs> yeah like you say, it's a big boy to be coming over the back of you when I head her <laughs> <laughs> certainly lets you know that you're in you're in for a game but a fair challenge as well nothing, nothing wrong oh absolutely it. absolutely Again, just getting the game back started. Looks forward to Taggart. He goes long looking for That's Henderson. That's a very good behind. ball. That's a good Go ball. On in, Go on in, Boydie. He's got a little bit of space there. Standing the defender up. Don't rush it then. Drops it back into Scott Taggart. Patient play from Aloha. It's a shame it wasn't quite on to put it in the box, yeah. so it was just the way it kind of came together. And now we're juggling in behind and Mendy's back to cover. And I think that ball's going to <laughs> throw it, I think it's just run it out. <laughs> <laughs> that will probably be a common theme for Alwa to try getting behind with, with uh, Henderson up top. That's how he got his, the winner last Sunday. It's yeah, He's just got such blistering pace, doesn't yeah, he? Yeah, hopefully we can use it to create space, though, for the likes of Kev and uh, Scrooge and Boydie. Mm -hmm. 
it's, it's certainly a threat and certainly something you should utilise, but I would like to see us see him stretch the game for that reason, so that we can get folk like Skugel and that on the ball. That's just what they're here to do. Yeah. They're here to get the ball in the pockets and play. Try and get tags in. Well, maybe more tags than Senna, but try and get tags in Senna high up the pitch as well. <laughs> folk probably say that about me as well, though, when I'm playing <laughs> left back. <laughs> Yeah, there is, there is a couple of McGills in this team, Scott McGill and Gavin McGill, so you, you were right pre-match. It's, it's uh, not easy being a commentator. Yeah, do, do your homework. <laughs> do your homework. Here's McEnroy at <laughs> the edge of the box. Sits out to the left. Easton dancing his way in. Fancies the effort. It's well wide. He's definitely got that in his locker. The good ability, the boy. I mean, thankfully for us. Doesn't get that one right, but... He's definitely wanting to be watched. He, he can kind of float in and out of games, but he's got yeah. that. He's got that. Ability. He's got. He's got the flair, and he's yeah. got that kind of wow factor, doesn't he? Um, and he started adding goals to his game this yeah, season. Yeah. So I would always look for. Him. And certainly, if I was his coach or manager, I'd be wanting goals out of him. Definitely. David Hutton goes long. It's easy for for a dice. Oh, oh, the second one. Right, and that is Callum Fordyce once more. Right over to McCabe. Still filling in at, at the back as well. Yeah, he's, he's played most of his games uh, at centre half this season. And alongside his cousin, I believe his cousin's with Callum Fordyce yeah, as well. A couple, so. couple of good West Oldian lads, they went, yeah. to, went to school with him. Oh, did you? I'm, I'm unfortunately slightly older than them, but <laughs> uh, yeah, they were uh, uh, from out my neck of the woods. A couple of good lads. Call me a traditionalist, but it's never nice seeing a number seven play centre. <laughs> said that you do away, but it just doesn't sound was well. It, was it Christoph Berra? Was it Berra at Dundee uh, with number seven? That was, that was, that was all sorts of wrong. That, yeah. Yeah. All sorts at of least McCabe's got a bit of flair in it, <laughs> like Berra. But Good Kev. Kev's done well to draw the fill there. Yeah. Scored a fine goal last Sunday. Oh, that's, that was one of my favourite moments of that game. And I think it's got forgotten about because it was in the first 30 seconds, but the, yeah. the first touch to set that up was beautiful. It was a great bit of play from, uh, from Kevin Crawley. I think Andy Graham was giving me and Senna a bit of stick because Senna just was uh, praising Scott Taggart for the most simple uh, five-yard uh, pass before yeah. it. I, I must admit, it crossed my <laughs> mind as well. That we didn't really say too much about it. It wasn't just, you know, you're talking about the first minute of the game to have that much composure. Yeah. Even, even his finish... He doesn't lash at it, he takes his time and yeah. just does what he needs to do. Um, aye, absolutely. Uh, pure, bit of pure class, play. that's yeah. really what it was. But no, you just didn't praise it enough. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry to get a word in when Senna starts to <laughs> Scott Tucker, to be fair. So. <laughs> yes, Taggart. One guy for Dyson. It's a big strike for Dyson's game as well. Yeah. Very, very strong in the air. For that one, drive him in. That is Boyd. He's just lost his foot in there, but he's done well to recover. Brings Gilmore into it. Oh, his pass is out to mend it. Just calming it down. Don't force it, you're right. Long looking for it. That's the chest of Ewan Henderson. That's pretty pinpoint. Yeah. From he's actually done well, but again, going down, going down the throat of them towards towards Dicey, something Dicey will fancy, so. And he's out, does well. He's the throw in for Alouette. Taggart's over to take that one. And we're just looking to Good. get back Turn. the second ball, and they do so. Good, nice and early, nice and early. Break on the left. Let's set up. I'll oh, pass away out of trouble very well, and it is Gilmore. Good time. Tags all day. That's a good ball out to Scott Taggart. Give him it again. He's got space to run into on that right hand side, but. Back. Go on, oh, go on it. Oh, my good good defender from Tags. Good defender, to be fair. I think that's the winger as well. Is that one of them? Not. It's Callum Smith, actually, isn't it? Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it is. 
he's, uh, he's quite unrecognisable. He's not got that bleach blonde hair that he had <laughs> when he was uh, when he's yeah, at Alba. Yeah, the baby face. <laughs> <and> then... <laughs> Here is McCabe. Looks to go along looking for Callum Gallagher. Again, he took up the second ball, but... Does just win the free kick off of Gilmore. It's a decent opportunity for the likes of Easton. I didn't actually see what happened there, but nobody's really making it. No, uh, so he just <laughs> kind of pulled him, pulled him back. They tried to play advantage, but doesn't seem to. Perfect position for a for someone with a decent left foot, isn't it? Yeah, it's far enough out. You can actually probably try and hit this with a bit of pace. But whether they do that or they try a, a Luca Connell special, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was something shoot, else. Shoot for anywhere. Easton does clip it into the box. I think that's get away. Senna. That was Senna as well. Yeah, it was Senna. Did yeah, an awkward one. Clear. Does enough though. Corner kick for the Jets. Yeah. So good afternoon. Those are such awkward balls to defend, aren't they? Coming in at that, yeah. that angle. Yeah. If they're struck properly, it's like very hard to defend. You've got to try and trust your line and, and hope that Hutz is, is talking to you as well. But they are. They're awkward. Again. It's pressing about the six-yard box. It might fall favourably for McEnroe. And it's fired wide to the post, but a warning shot there from Airdrie. It seemed like Hutton was just crowded out there. Aye, he struck that well, McEnroe, actually. He struck that really well. For this angle for a minute, I was, <laughs> you don't know. I was panicking. Aye. <laughs> Hutton looks to, to go along. I thought about the short run to Tiger, but maybe push Senna for, for, further up here to win this. Yes, for this again. It's just, like you say, he's just going to eat that up all day. But he's, he's a, he's, he isn't even the biggest, I wouldn't say, that say but he's, he's very good in there, very strong. That's good though from Henderson. Here's Boyd, Boyd running at the air to defence. Yeah. Latch onto that. Was passing the girls just hugged down by Gilmer. <laughs> much complaints about that. No. <laughs> no. He's done well though since coming in. He has Charlie Gilmore. I he's like him. I like him. He's got he's he's got a bit of dig about him. Um, and he'll learn because last week he picked up an early booking. Yeah. And, and I think that was a tackle, you know, you maybe don't need to make. Yeah. Certainly not in that fashion, but that's that you, you learn that throughout playing. Yeah. It's not it's not even to do with age, it's just you, know, you learn that as you go because yeah. you, you're walking a tightrope after that against a good side who are going to knock yeah, it about exactly. yeah. it was definitely a heart in the, the mouth moment especially uh, after the last couple of weeks I know I know up a week. Exa <laughs> exactly and you, you can't you won't well we're not getting away with it you can't keep doing that obviously yeah. so uh, but he has got that in his game and he's also obviously got the quality which we saw in the, the final minutes of the game as well so yeah, fantastic goal for the fourth goal Gilmore just picks up that loose ball there. Good turn, that's a great ball. Great ball. And how he can spread it out and oh, uh, can look to attack. Lovely pass for Senna and they've just opened yeah. everything up. It's long looking for Henderson. <sighs> coming forward. I think it's important, like you said, to get likes of Collie, Boyd and Skugel in, involved in the game as much as yeah. possible. It's kind of absolutely it's, it's gone from defence to attack a little bit and yeah. just skipped them so far. Absolutely. Early days but definitely. And and even even Hendel obviously you want to you want to keep him bright and keep him involved and he's a he's a very strong lad but balls up to his head and it's not what he's looking for certainly. Tenacious feet, play there very good feet as well. Rizzo. Yeah. 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 Just, yeah. uh, just can't quite get the full yeah. into it. Yeah. Oh, good. Eventually deal with it. Yeah, just put it out for a good cool kick. Yeah, good track. Good work for Boydie. Not not the part of the pitch you want him in, but he's yeah. back there digging away. Good work for him. Settled yet, but we'll get there. Yeah, it's, it's, been a bit of a, it's been a bit of a frantic start. A lot of the games yeah. has been played up in the air, to be fair, but 
Oh, that'll be man. That's a good though from Kevin Crawley. Just when your head doesn't win the second ball, <laughs> that's what you need to do. So yeah. Another one. Ve very good in the air for a wee guy, Kev. It's, yeah, it very is, good. Yeah. He's got a lot of headers even in my time here. I think I, 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 if I was, if I had a pound for every time my granddad said the smallest guy in the park's won a header, <laughs> <laughs> I'd be a very rich man. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. <laughs> but no, he does well, and it's just sheer intelligence, like you said. The same with the touch; he just knows where to be and when to jump and when to time yeah. it, doesn't he? It's, it's timing. That's what that's what it is. It's bit of a loose pass, but Hutton's quick off his line. Yeah, and the Edge fans enjoyed that one. <laughs> <laughs> Slips. Knocks out for a shite. <laughs> uh, Hutz will be keen to try and put the last result right as well, obviously, for obvious reasons. Yeah. It's a perfect day for this one. It's such a sweat. It's an asset. No wind, yeah, yeah, no wind. Got to try and use the surface. Uh, we get, oh, we get. It's McCabe over to for a dice. I'll just count in my positions. Good. And maybe they'll latch onto it, it's a wee bit of a slip. That was unlucky. Maybe uh, caught him, but. Yeah. The, boy, the, boy's, the boy's lucky because he's, <laughs> he's, he's slipped and he's lost position. It's anyway. actually then invited the tackle, which is yeah. now leading to this, but. Uh, opportunity to get the ball into the box and get the centre halves up. Ball does come in from Easton, it's deep. Good. That's a good take from Hutton. Can we play? I suppose that's the, is that the call from the manager to play it from the back? At um, most um, occasions, is it mixing? Uh, no, he's, 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 he's a lot more, um, he's a lot more, uh, not direct, I'm not saying he's telling us to go long, but no, it's not as emphasised on as it was the yeah. previous managers. Because we've um, always been a team yeah. known for passing it and playing yeah. good football. Yeah. Um, it's it's something he set his stall out on early on that he you know he didn't want us to do it needlessly, um, which he felt we maybe did do the last couple of seasons mm. on the times he saw us. And it, you know you could argue a point that maybe we did. Um, he's done well with that actually. He's got some <laughs> bit of trouble. We've had hesitation, but he's, yeah. he's done well. Same. That's another it's lovely ball. Yeah, it's good. It's Timey man. Skiggle's done well. He's got Boyd on the left for support. <sighs> Just come out. So there are options in the box. He's done well and he's won the foul. Yeah. That's, that's exactly what he's doing, Boyd. And it's, yeah. it's Very clever, but great feet as well. Yeah, good feet kick to win. I'd like to have seen Skooks commit what's in there a bit more to mm. free Boyd with that pass, but sometimes you just want to give it to Boyd his feet and let him go and do his thing. But try and isolate him with Watson, that might be something we can jump on. It's a decent area for Stephen Boyd to whip one into the mix. Yeah, a chance for us to get one in the box. It's a low one and it's bounced about a six yard box and it's out for a goal kick. An awkward one. It was. It's certainly something though, even from last week, that we were frustrated with, especially in the first half because our set pieces and delivering it in the box. Getting into good areas. Um, that was an awkward one, but I think Boyd would expect himself to put in a more dangerous yeah. ball as well. <coughs> Max Curry with the goal kick. How to do win it well? It's now Callum Gallagher. Out the left to Easton. Cam Smith's pounded out by Coley. Good Kev, excellent. That. Excellent. I could be a yellow card to be fair as well. Uh, I think be harsh, but. Yeah, I think it was more, if we were breaking away at pace maybe, but Kev yeah. knows what he's doing there. He didn't have a lot on. And he's, he saw that coming and got us out of trouble. That's, that's really good play. Really good experience. Yeah. Yeah. Something you see Trouts do a lot as well, very good at that. Good tags. That's a good touch from Tag. Ah, I'm lucky, Scoots. I'll do keep possession, though. Tag just 
just looking for options at the throw in, goes down the line for Skiggle, but it's intercepted. And just to clear it. Oh, a wee bit of confusion there between the defence and. I think Dernan's got a yellow card for that. A, that was a strange one. Yeah, uh, it was a strange one. I don't think Dernan really knew too much of yeah, what he was doing. I'm not convinced he did either, to be fair. And I don't think the boys ever get to the ball. But they, you can, they look like a team a wee bit of confidence here, Ray. You can see the you know, you've got McCabe and Fordyce happy to take the ball, happy to happy to go long but happy to keep it. They they do, they look like a team you know, they are in form. Like yeah. you, you did say that as they came out. They are in form, so uh, I don't yes. it's like, uh, I don't think the ref really knew what he was doing there. <laughs> I think he's decided at the last minute I better give that. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't really there was much in it. Do take it quickly though and get the game moving. Yeah. Right. Make me one two there from here. Jimmy's driving into the box, Dunham's over to cover it, but eventually good. It's big how he doing his defensive role in midfield. Yes. <laughs> I think he likes a bit of that. Another one that's done, you know, he's, had, he's been in and out, various positions, but does does well. It's a good strike, to be yeah, fair. Yeah, it's always rising, but it's yeah. another, another chance there for Airdrie. Yeah. But no, Craig Howe is one that I've been particularly impressed with as well. Yeah. I always kind of assumed he would be centre-half when he signed, but he looks very comfortable in the middle of the park. Yeah, park. especially, you know, even you know back in the team last week, again, playing against, you know, at that point, you know, the top, the, the league leaders and... <laughs> A tough one to get thrown in. They've done very well, and he's been asked to play, you know, a number of positions as well, and he's got the ability to do that. So I've been like, like you. I've, I've been impressed with Craig as well. And he's big slip back here. <laughs> I think that's how his header went. And last week he just <laughs> slipped off the gel. <laughs> Fizzle picks up the second ball and so he passes well to be fair. Senna should intercept that. Boyd just wants to just get out and tidy that up, me man. First time. Sneak from Senna. Ah, he's got his arms around him. Oh, we'll take it. We'll take it. <laughs> right. I think we're lucky to get away with that, but yeah. we will take it. We don't complain about the rest no, of the game. No, no, like that, no, no. Strange decision. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think of him. Is it McEnroy? I think of him. McEnroy, I'm not happy. But, oh, that's <laughs> a plus, yeah. but we'll take it. The referee used to be my PE teacher in school, so every time he comes here, <laughs> he always has a stinker. <laughs> Did you call him Mr. whatever his name is M when you saw him? Aye, Mr. Cook. It's, Mr. Always, Cook. it's always Mr. Yeah, Cook. Yeah, yeah. No matter how many years I've Aye. got, uh, even though I've Do you even know his first name? <laughs> I'm scared to look. <laughs> <laughs> But um, yeah, he's one of those ones you see. You see him in the car park and, and the Rex or something. You just put your head down and hope <laughs> he doesn't see you. <laughs> <laughs> when you're in the stands, pal, it's much abuse. You'd, you'd, you be, you'd have been the boy of the cross country though at the front. No, uh, you'd have been. No, I was. I wasn't as good a runner as I was <laughs> back in school, so that's why right. he doesn't like me. But here's Skugo, more what importantly. A, yeah, I know. What a ball that is for boy. To be fair. Here's Taggart. Can you get a ball in Scott? It's chopped inside. Oh, Dava drops it back into Howie. Oh, and Hedges has got a bit of space, and I thought he was going to just turn and yeah, slot good that spot. home. But here's Taggart again, drives it in. Oh, well done. Well done. Cleared out for a corner kick. It's a good clearance, to be fair. That's coming at pace. Crawley was just waiting on that one yeah. to come through to him yeah. to finish it. Tags. Is, I love when watching Tags get to the byline because he's always looking for that wee sort of penalty spot area cut back. Very rarely just kind of thrashes it across the goal. There's always a bit of, a bit of thought about it. Let's not go on about tags too much though, that, that, happened. <laughs> that happened last week. <laughs> Skiggle to deliver. It's cleared well by Urge, but I'm a Stramash, but ball's going to come in again. Again, it's low and it's not quite where we want it. Oh, so now you don't need to make that challenge. You don't need to make that tackle. Just relieves all the pressure for Urge. Yeah. Again, it's at Senna, much like uh, Charlie, they're both, you know, it's a big part of their game. They're, they're strong, they're fit, they, they hound and hassle people, and 
just learn as you go yeah. what ones you can win and not win. And, and, and there, you know, we're looking at another corner. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <sighs> I think the keeper will be happy to slow this down. That was a, just a, was a wee five minute spell where we found ourselves in their half. So. Yeah, it's been, it's been a better spell than the kind of first open. They're just finding their feet a little bit yeah. more. Oh, and it does commit to it, does come off. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Poor left, big man. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll see in you what he's doing. <laughs> It's a lovely touch, yeah. but you couldn't really see from here what. He's just if lost his foot in a little yeah. bit. Uh, obstructed a wee bit, I'm not too sure, but well, I assume the Lino had a good view for there, so. <coughs> not been too many chances for either side yet, despite no. some promising spells, but neither keeper really tested. No, not yet, no. A couple of life yet, but Mendy commits again and misses out. But Dermot should deal with that and does. It's good from Howie. We've got people like Howie and uh, Charlie in front. Yeah, I think Nando needs to be so keen mm -hmm. to go and win those headers. Yeah. Yes, boy, day. yes, boy. Day. Watson just drops it into Easton. So ah, it's one of the times a good time there from number 10. Yeah. Space out in the left. They've worked that quite well. We disappointed with the final ball yeah. there. A lovely wee turn by, by Easton in the middle of the park. Which again we spoke about. He's got he has got that in his locker. Um, yeah. He's always been a player ever since he was um, at Clyde under Barry actually, would it have been under Barry when he was at Clyde all those years ago? You might be right, probably you would have be been, right. but ever since then he's, he's always been pretty highly rated in, in well, the lower leagues, though. but it's good to play from Henderson yeah. to call him into it. I remember he had, a, he had a loan spell at Dumbarton, mm. that was the first time I'd come across him when Dumbarton went in the championship. Um, and he, he was at St Johnston, that's yeah. the first time I'd come across and you could see what kind of player he was even yeah. then. But it's good to see him playing at a, a level like this as opposed to somewhere like Kelty Hearts in the, in the Lowland League because it's you want players that are capable of playing League One Championship, playing League One Championship, but... Yeah, uh, no, absolutely, I'd agree with that. I'd agree with that. Although the way th things are going in League Two, <laughs> it might not be long until, that's until they join us, but that's, that's true. Hell yeah. Obviously, a hell yeah budget and a hell yeah squad they've put together there, so... Hold. Yeah, does it? Wins the ball well. Watson's done well to pick pocket. Henderson though and knock it down the line to Calum Gallagher and that's yeah, a little bit too much there from Dunman. Does he need to make the tackle? I'm not, I don't think he's done a much. I don't think he's done much, but when you raise two hands, you're always kind of yeah. The risk, aren't you? You've given you've given Cal a uh, uh, striker. You've given him a, a chance to. Make the ref make a decision, and now you're defending mm. this. You know, just he's not going anywhere. That's the point there. I think he's not going anywhere. Is McNoy to whip it in with his left foot? Keep going. A little bit wild again. Yeah, yeah. 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 Deliveries from both Aye. sides haven't been on point today. Yeah. The frustration of both managers. I think yeah, kind of. It's maybe summed up the first sort of quarter, or just half half an hour of this game. Yeah, five minutes. I don't do particular stats like that, but it'd be interesting to see, you know, how many games are won and lost with things like set pieces and, you know, yeah. how many goals over the season you, you create or get from things like that. Oh, you're there, you're there, keep him there. And he's hounded well him done. down, he pushes, forces him back to his left back. Go on in, Boydie. Thank you, Boyd, nip in. So uh, close. I'm lucky. Oh, I do win back possession. Forward, Henderson will chase that one down. Yeah, yeah. that's certainly not 
They're not sure what to do between yeah. the two of them. Keeper was definitely not getting there. Can Scribble bring this one down? I don't want to let them out of that though. He's, yeah, he's, fit. he's missed on well, but Kev. He's also done very well to get out of that, isn't yeah. the boy McGill? And he's been dragged down by Crawley. And that's, oh. I'm happy with that because he actually lost his own footing. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think that is actually a very sharp decision for the ref. You've got better eyesight than me, John. Oh, what was that? You've got better eyesight than me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't actually think there was a lot of a tackle. I think yeah. he'd already lost his footing and he was on the way down. And he's just brought... brought having done so down. well a second ago. Yeah. <laughs> you probably expect to get it, just having got out of that situation. But Scoog's early. That's Taggart. He opts for it. Up against Smith. Down the line looking for Collie, but still covered off from Mac and Wright. <laughs> Throw in goes down the line. Tickets done well to win that. Well done, me man. Well done. Floyd's He's held up well against yeah. the big boy Watson. Yeah. Uh, I've got possession, Gilmore looking what for that. Get down. Ah, oh, lucky. That's a little bit too much on it, but the right idea, Henderson was, looked like he was timing his run well. Yeah. That's a part of, going back to the initial part of that's a part of Boydie's game I've been impressed with. Not just his pace and, you know, his ability to run at people. He's, he's, he's a strong wee guy and he, and he doesn't get pushed about. He doesn't allow himself to get pushed about. Um, does he not own a, a personal trainer business or something like that? Is he not like a PT or something to do with the He gym? certainly was. Yeah. I think that has uh, recently ended, but I think that's Boydie's story to tell. Yeah, um, so. um, but yeah, he's, he certainly is a... Obviously, there's not much to him. But he's, he's aggressive as well. He's not just strong, he's actually aggressive with it. Oh, we're just coming into this game and put some more pressure on here, Jay, but it's a good challenge. Yeah, Watson's read it well and right. passes Tags. through, though. And he gets it out early to his right back. Travel. Good. Just keeping possession, coming it down. Wrong with that from Alwa. Looking for an opening. Keep up! Keep up! Kevin Crawley. Alright, go hot, that's fine. Chase down, but Hutton does get it clear Good to Scoogle. Excellent. That's brilliant, and now Henderson can run at this area yeah. to defence. He's got Scoogle up with him. He Could he play him? alone? On his left foot. Oh, what Brian a Hendel. goal from Ewan Henderson. Two goals last Sunday, and he's open to scoring here. Driving at the defence and clipping it in with his left foot. I was about to have a go at him for no passing the ball. <laughs> uh, that's the only thing he could have done when he opted not to pass to Scoogle. That's a beautiful finish from Henderson. The keeper didn't even move for it. I would like to see the replay to see where the keeper was there. Yeah. It's strange how it's it's a good finish. It is a good finish. I say I was I was opting for the pass early, but. <laughs> He's, he shot me right up to be fair. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant from Scoogle as well to bring him into the game yeah, with that. With absolutely. That um, um, you see, he's just trying to take it in with the ball's coming to him. And it's, it, he's done well and it's also fell quite kindly for Hendo. And that's what we want Hendo doing turning yeah. and running at people, using his pace. Good composure as well. Three. Good time to open the score in 10 minutes till half time. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Never a bad time to score. Yeah, that's, Never a bad that's time to true. score. That's true. Oh, I think I'm not going to raise tons, but it's good to call if I come for it. Man. Yeah, it's, it's done well. And I would like to see us get higher up the park now. Yeah. You know, it's to get our press a little bit. There's Long. Hutton should come off his line for that. That's right. Really yeah, it's sharp off his line. Hutt's very sharp. I guess probably been his best feature that, that we've noticed sitting up here is his quick distribution and and how quick he is off yeah, his line. Yeah, yeah. Tries to do things very quickly. 
there is times obviously you need you need him to do the opposite but yeah. no he is he's quick off his line and if you know that as a defender um, you know you're getting that most of the time it's, it's easy to kind of work with it's a good touch initially from Henderson but it's just kind of outstrengthened there and Easton looks to clip it forward oh. to Miguel but again just what we're talking about <laughs> he's some boy hurts as well, man. <laughs> he's, he's, a, oh he's a great character in the dressing room. East, yeah. East. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how, quite how to word it. <laughs> I think what you've said probably explains or, it all. Or what I've not said. Mr. <laughs> 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 Caves looking forward looking for that long ball clips it down the line and behind Senna but Tottenham are covering all over him Edry Boy's done well to find Frizzle he can sweep, spread it out Open up, Senna. Talk to money. well done Scoogle that's brilliant Stefan Scoogle to win that back well done Tags that's brilliant as well and he's just hooked down there and that should yeah, be a that, card. That'll do. That'll just got a booking as well. I'd have thought. Yeah, it's Miguel. I just wondered when we won that back initially. There, there was Hendo was in space. Could we have went forward quickly? But sometimes when you just win it back, you're just looking to slow it down again. But brilliant for Kev. He's <laughs> well. We talk about Kev's flair and his ability to turn on a turn on a sixpence. He's he's, he's dogged as well. He's as a, I played a lot of right back in, over the years when in front of me and it Boyd fancies it and it's straight not mind that. Not not mind that but yeah quite entitled to it Boyd especially with his start to the season in terms of goals yeah already equaled his, his high school scoring tally for the season yeah. and we're only in and, and much like I'm saying about you know Eastern Airdrie I'm certainly from what I've seen for Boyd I'll be looking for mm -hmm. you know 10 plus from somebody with his ability and his technique to go and strike a ball, definitely. So he's slipped from Howie that allows Easton in, but I will eventually get Good. it cleared. Up we get. Oh, yeah, well done, Charlie. Right the of Gilmore, but fired at him, to be fair. <laughs> he's going to another, he's gonna get another take, though. <laughs> right back to him, but... Uh, Reese will, will be happy to take the ball there all day and we're also happy for him to have it there but he has got he's got a good range of passing so you just need to be aware he's going to look for that now and again switches it out to for Dice see him when he gets it he's looking he's looking forward but he's looking long early he's looking for a run um, well played yeah, Boyle it's a neat wee touch in from Boyd to Henderson play him, play him. he's got Scoogle ah, there ah he's seen he's tried to well done ref well done not he's got the throw it he's got the free kick though and I think he's going to go in the book as well Watson Aye, I think the pass was maybe actually to Scoog's feet there but I can see what he's tried to play he's obviously under pressure when he tries to play it as well good play again though turning and being positive being strong just go to sin Good. Yeah, take a shot. Let's go out to Senna. Just clip that in. Looking for Boyd. Very well, actually. Yeah. Oh, unlucky. It's unlucky for Boyd. Yeah. But again, I need to pass from Senna. He's yeah. certainly looking, looking sharp. Yeah. And it is. It's just. It's natural just to take that touch inside on your right. Um, you're playing that position. Down, always gonna get that. Yeah. There he is again. Just maybe one you don't have to make, but it's part of his game, so you don't want him to you don't want him to take out of Charlie's game either. I think you saw it there, Reese McCabe as well when we played them. I think he tried to score for the halfway line early on, didn't he? Yeah, I think he did. Uh, <laughs> it wasn't the worst there for that actually either. <laughs> Dice driving forward. 
It's it's a ball in from Watson. He's with early with it as well. He's dealt with it. Ah, uh, Brody Jones knocked that off of McGill. Just a couple of minutes to half time, supporting Alwa, hold on. Oh, it's a quick first half. Yeah, it's, <laughs> it's, quick, it's good when yeah. you're having fun. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> good. It's good, we're chasing it down. We're just throwing it again. I always say that about Stefan Skugel for how much of a classy player he is. He's another one that doesn't yeah, shy away I, from the dirty I'm, I'm, side either. You know, I'm looking at our three that are obviously playing behind Hendo. Obviously, <laughs> they're all they're all wee fun-sized guys, but they're aggressive, they're strong, they, they get in about you. All three of them do, actually. It's a good point you make, because I mentioned it with Boyday, but Kevin Skugs are very similar. McEnroy forward to Frizzle, he looks to just... Ah, brilliant, yeah. 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 brilliant, brilliant. From Alawat. That's fine. Looks oh. like he's knocked off his hands. Yeah. I actually thought that helped us as well. <laughs> <laughs> Fell to the feet of Collie a little bit better, Yeah, but that's what, this is what we want, just to kind of slow the game down. Yeah. A couple of minutes till half-time. Yeah, I think get to half-time now, you would take... You'd have to say Barry would be pretty happy with that first team, uh, would, that first half performance. I would think so. I, I think it has been, you know, like I think you said a few minutes before the goal, there's not been too many chances to talk about. Um, but we've managed to fashion one, and, and, and it's a good finish, like we said, for Hendo. So definitely half time, a goal up uh, against Airdrie's never, never a bad thing. Out you go, Kev. Well done. Space out in the left. Yeah. Get it to Senna. Go, oh, Kev. Go, oh, Kev. That's fine. Well played. That's good. Play from our first touch pass. Yeah. Hen. Howie. Senna just hounded down by Frizzle, but throw in Alwa. Confident play there from the likes of Coley and Boyd. Yeah. Starting to enjoy themselves a little bit more. Again, that's why you need to keep them involved in the game, because... They can open you up with moves and passages and play like that. Just throw your feet. Yeah, that's going to lot of handle there again. Collie's done well to win that one, though. Andy brings it down. And it's Airdre latch onto his touch. Might get, I thought he might have pulled that back, but yeah, not, not given on Smith and Alward. Get away with that a little bit there. Do you know, I was actually going to be complimentary on Nando for, for bringing it down. Because, you know, I always want to see that. You know, used to, the last five years I've been seeing it with obviously Big Andy and yeah. you know, other people that have played. So I was going to be complimentary, but it <laughs> nearly backfired. It's good to be touch in from Boyd. And Gilmore looks to give him it back. We've got a second crack at it. And that's that should be a free kick. It'll be interesting where he goes with this. It's going to be a yellow yeah. card. But don't have the, the pleasure of a replay. No, but, uh, <laughs> not quite there yet. No, no VAR, no. Three yellow cards to Rudy in the first first half, but it's a, it's a strong challenge, isn't it? It, it looks strong. You, it, you, a, a slight bit of sympathy for for, for the tackle is, and the, you know, the ball's kind of fell there um, by chance, and he thinks he's winning it. That's the okay. Without seeing it again to see if it was actually yeah, a bit yeah, reckless. Yeah. Um, you know, it, was, it was a 50 50 at that time, but Charlie's done well to, to get there first. You can guarantee if it was last week and Senna was sitting here up on commentary, he'd, he'd be quick to tell you <laughs> uh, that he would have got sent off for yeah. that. <laughs> yeah, he's not bitter about it at all. No. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, it looks like Gilmore will be okay. I'd imagine it would. Yeah, just one of those ones, such an impact, it's probably going to. Also, right at the end of the half, but it's not in the worst position to go in. It's definitely in, in boys' territory. Oh, Skugel is sniffing about it as well. Yes. I don't think. You naturally think this favours the right footer, but I mean, 
if you're going around the outside of the wall, you never know. I'd, I'd have fancy boy to hit it though. Yeah, he's, he's got history this season as well. He's got he's got one down already. That kind of puts you on. Exactly. That kind of puts you on them for the rest of the season, <laughs> really, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Does look like it will be Stephen Boyd. I would fancy him to just have a go here and try and test the keeper right on half time. Let's see why not. Boyd with the free kick. And it's a good save from Curry. Comfortable height for the for goalkeeper. For that reason, yeah. Nets, for that reason. Tested him. Good free kick, good save. Yeah. Another opportunity from the corner. Scoogle will be hoping for a better delivery. It's not a particular short, but nah, not at this point, sure. Nah. Not at this point of the, of the half. Good ball. That is a decent ball. Get and it's McDurnan, and it's into the hands of Curry, but. It was a big Lyndon Dykes ish. Let's go with the studs, eh? <laughs> the question. It's, a, it's also an area, you know, I look at our team even today, our back four and the two in front of them, you know, big powerful lads, you know, Vinny and Nando, big, big boys, I'd hope they could chip in with a few this season. Obviously, uh, big Craig managed to do that last week. I can't imagine there's much longer to go in this half. No, I can't imagine so. Nothing silly, Senna. Boys done very, well, very well done. And it back in our well keep possession. Just on the half time mark and might be able to fasten one more chance. It's great ball for Charlie there as well. I'm happy about it. He's been demanding it off a lot, so he's not getting it. He's just going to go down the line. They can't put too much time in this half left. Strong from Senna, though. Good, 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 good feet. Get himself out of this situation. Good. <laughs> good do us then. And Barry Cook does blow for half time. Al will go into the break 1 0 up thanks to Ewan Henderson's strike on 35 minutes. It's been a game of little chances so far, but it's Alawa that just stick their noses in front. Some thoughts on the first half? I think that sums it up. That there really hasn't been a lot of chances to talk about. Even Hendo's goal, I, I'm not looking at it thinking it was a, a glaring opportunity to score. <laughs> it's, it's a it's a nice finish in the end, but no, not a lot of not a lot of goal mouth actually, not a lot of chances or saves to talk about. Maybe a wee a wee bit at the end with the free kick for yeah. Boydie, but I think that was also one that was probably comfortable for the keeper in the end as well. But the important stat is that Alou are one 0 up at the break. Absolutely, That's all that matters. We'll take a quick 10-15 minute break. Go grab yourself a cup of tea, and we'll be back for the second half. To the second half. Aloha currently leads 1 0 and just going through their wee sprinty things again. <laughs> wee sprinty things. <laughs> <laughs> it was, it was <laughs> <in> the crowd. <laughs> Call them shocks. Call them shocks. <laughs> wee sprinty things isn't they going to fly, man? <laughs> <laughs> At least it's not too. It could be that when we had Paul Hartley. Did you ever play the Aloha's, uh, Paul Hartley's Aloha team? You used to, get, did, the bun, used to get the ropes no, out. I, I remember yeah. seeing that because he was big on all that um, and the lads used to talk about the. The sort of sports scientist yeah, or the trainer yeah, yeah, yeah. they had when, Paul, when Hartley was here, and you used to see them tied up to the railings and, uh, and uh, do their jumps and headers uh, and whatnot. It's a lot of things, isn't it? I suppose <laughs> the, one, the one percent, <laughs> the one percent. I, listen, players, I, I'm, I, I'm, I've got quite a, a big interest in you know nutrition, sports mm. science, sports science, sorry, things like that. Obviously, not all of it, but I'm. I've always liked my, my own individual training and doing extra, so I, I'm, I'm laughing about it, but it, it's something that interests me. So, yeah. And it is, it's, you know, we things, we one percent that maybe help you prepare. Not everybody needs it, not everybody requires it, but it, it does benefit some people, and if you buy into it... Then yeah, that, that's the main thing, isn't yeah. it? If you do anything with half effort, it's not going to be any use, but if no. you properly invest in it, then... You're going to get what it's intended for, I that's, suppose. That's another thing about, you know, you've got a team of players, everybody's different, everybody mm. prepares differently. 
some folk need to be you know horizontal, laid back, chilling, drinking yeah. a coffee. Other people need to be on their toes, you know, mm -hmm. like, you know doing things. It's, it's, it's good. To, it's interesting to see when you're in a changing room. Actually, yeah. how everybody prepares differently. Kim McCauley will kick us off for the second half. Barry Cook's just... You know, a wee bit more tempo and yeah. put, put them under a bit more pressure. Do you think that's what Barry will be saying to the boys at half-time, just kind of lift it a bit and... Or seeing potentially, potentially for both sides. I think, yeah. you know, Andrew have obviously brought an Aggie in the middle of the park, maybe looking to stretch us a wee bit with his range of passing. Um, we'll find out as the game develops, but I think both, maybe both managers... But not that we'll be disappointed, but they'll maybe be looking for a bit more yeah. um, going forward, certainly. Yep, Scott Agnew is on for Gavin McGill. Uh, not Gavin McGill, Scott McGill. Uh, see, see. No, it is Gavin. Oh, it's still uh, lawyer. Uh, it's, it's, <laughs> it's Gavin McGill. <laughs> Commit, committed. Uh, well, uh, I'm slagging. I don't know. So <laughs> <laughs> But I, kept, I just said Aggie was on. Yeah. Yes. It's got Aggie on for Gary McGill. <laughs> <laughs> just a wee reshuffle from, from Airdrie as well. It looks yeah, like, it looks like Easton's wider. Yeah, and Smith's come a little bit further forward. Yeah. And more central. Yeah. Am I right in saying Scott Agnew is now involved in the coaching side at Airdrie as well? Is he as assistant manager or as, fa as far as I'm aware, he yeah. is. Um, I think he's definitely got that in him. I've um, played against Aggie quite a lot, uh, sort of over the years. And, ah, he's, a, he's always been a good player. Mm -hmm. Always had great technique, and I, I think you could see him being good at coaching. And he obviously, I think his business is in and around that as well. Yeah, you know, like coaching people and Hinges things like that, chasing it down, asking the question. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Just been a nuisance and nothing. Yeah, you see what again, you can get. the ball starts bouncing about at the back. You know. a good old train, don't let it bounce. But. Yeah, Aggie will do this all day. Yeah. And, and, and look to kind of spread the play a bit. Mm -hmm. um, good, Kev. Oh, okay. Fizzle just gets the turn and here comes Dylan Easton looks to slip through Open Callum up Scott. Smith. Good. Yeah, no, go well done. Mendy reads it well, knocks out for a corner. This pillar's killing me, but I had always wanted to move up. No. <laughs> <laughs> I am mean, a couple. Of, yeah. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> corner comes in. And down to the boat is Tiger that gets rid of it. Just started, started brightly, which you would expect. They probably would have got more of a kind of rock up their backside than Alwa would have at yeah. half time. Yeah, they're going to look to start sh yeah. strong. Kind of how the first half started actually. Um, Reese, Reese and Dicey getting a lot of the ball. Mm -hmm. you're, you're now adding into that uh, Aggie, and they definitely look to stretch us with, with balls like that. Smith keeps it in, but it's well read from Taggart. Brilliant tags. And that's great defending from Scott Taggart. He's done really well there. Tags. McCabe again looking to kick start another attack. We'll take that. Yep. And Hutton will just let that trickle out for a goal kick. Does look like it's going into that area. <laughs> Easton picks up the second ball and looks to get in behind, but it's over. It's a good clean at that as well, actually. If it was yeah. Yards on it, it was quite awkward. 
Vinny had shouted that much last week he lost his voice by the end of the game. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't take any guesses for, for why he gets uh, the nickname Vinny. <laughs> <laughs> it's good from Boyd. Good. Yeah, oh, it's Henderson. He He's driving that. into the box on his left foot. Yes, and it's and go. into the back of it again from Ewan Henderson. Excellent. Hopefully he, settle us right down. Yeah. Lovely finish again, though, on his on his left as well. Composed from Henderson. He doubles Aloha's lead. He doubles his tally. And like you say, after a tricky start to the half just calms everything right yeah, down yeah yeah just had us kind of in our half for the sort of first five minutes there Edu would probably have been thinking this is how we want to see out this game but that that will settle us down a lot and I tell you what if he's meant that and I think he has yeah it's a brilliant header for Boydie That's on, good. The, on the bounce to, to pick Kendall out with that it's a very very good header might look easier than it actually is when he plays that. And compose from Henderson in such a tight area, so many both, bodies in the box. Both and goals, you know, yeah. he's, not, he's not thrashed at his first one either. Um, which is definitely what you want. Just keep feeding them. He's just, yeah. He's, when they're in form like this, just keep feeding them. Ball eventually does find its way back to the back. <laughs> I was just saying, Barry had a clue what was going on there. <laughs> so I'm going to go with someone anyway. Yeah, a few choice ones for the gaffer. <laughs> I don't know who that, but. <laughs> You've made me look like a fool along the lines of that. Isn't it half a long throw? It's into a dangerous area. That's straight off the match. Well done to it. No, I think. He's encouraged to take it quickly. He's it's a good ball. Ah, well done, Ken. Brilliantly taken down from the call it. I was hoping on that occasion he might slow it down, but it's a good ball out to Kev. Taggart goes down the line looking for Henderson. Oh, should get that second ball. Henderson Hendo. chasing it down again and getting more joy. He thought about it, caught between two minds, yeah, I think. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Galica, neat feet there, and it's, it's going to be a free kick there. It was unlucky, it was good pressing for Hendel, but the yeah. way the ball actually ended up falling, yeah. it almost started a counter attack for, for Airdrie. And yeah. like you see, Senna then gets caught half and half. Do I go, do I sit? It's not always easy to make that decision. No. And I don't think there any surprises who's at this. <laughs> I think you'll fancy a shot from here. I think you'll clip it in. No, I don't fancy him putting, I don't think there's going to be a cross at all. Either, actually, for either of them, I don't think either of them's thinking about crossing this. Yeah. Will be Agnew to take it. It's right off the head of Kevin Crawley. Fizzle that's knocks like, it out to Easton. Ball, to be fair. Well done, Senna. Yeah, good from Senna, though. Nice wee lofted pass to Fizzle there, though. Yeah. It's good defender, good defender for Senna. I mean, in two and a lot in the second half, you're gonna you're gonna get a lot of this. If, you know, yeah. if you see the throws you just to make sure you're set up. Well done, yeah. How he gets rid of it and probably make sure of it. Yeah. Still looking to get the ball back in play as quickly as he can. <laughs> Even hand those faces. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. It was better. It was good last season when it was Peter Grant and the, the, the stands were empty and we used to have Peter Grant watch on, the, on this side. Like, some of the shouts that he would come out with yeah. would be quite crazy. It, I, used to, I used to struggle with Peter because you know during the week he was a completely different human being. Yeah. <laughs> you know, a, a really nice guy. You know, really interested in his players, but then. I don't know what he Maybe had for breakfast or what, what he drank before he came to the games. He became a, a different animal. Yeah. 
Yeah, we had to move many microphones away from the whole <laughs> <the home> bucket. <laughs> <laughs> Henderson chasing it down again, but uh, into the hands of Curry. Resistant. Good. Yep, stood up right there. Sometimes you do, you just need to set off. It's a big throw in behind Senna, and it's just. He slipped and yeah. handled the ball. I think that's got to be a foul. Like he's 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 handled he, the ball, yeah, is he not? Throwing his arms out, but no free kick given. The ball does come into the box. Yeah, but good. It then leads to that, though. You know. You'll get that for Cal as well, Calm Gallagher. He's yeah. no, no minutes rest when you're playing against him. He's, he's everywhere. Scored against us last time as well. Good. Yeah, no, he's, he's the first goal. He's, you know, he's a bit of an all-rounder, good in the air. That is Scott McGill coming off, so now there we go. both McGills are off. So <laughs> that's, that's Don't that's have to worry about that anymore. That's my confusion sorted. <laughs> and um, Salim Kudaresa coming on, scored the winner in that pretty crazy game against Dumbarton the other week. Yeah. He's a player that's always interesting me. He really kicked on at Queen's Park. He was really good for, for Queen's before they in, in League Two. Never quite worked out Airdrie, eh, at Livingston so far, but Right, is he still on loan? He's still, still on loan, he's still on loan yeah. yeah. This is his, is his second loan spell. I think he went back to back to Hamden on loan and now, yeah. now back at Airdrie. Right. This year and last year as well, Livy have had good strikers out doing doing bits. You know, the boy, yeah, the boy at Arbroath now is yeah. getting a lot of plaudits. Big, big yeah. Jack Hamilton, who was here and done well, really well for Arbroath actually last season. I did do well, a little bit too well. <laughs> Absolutely. Um, even you could see the progression in him from when he was here. He done, done well for us, but yeah. then he kicked on another level. Well, both absolutely. Frizzle, he's just he's waited for that. He's yeah. seen how he's coming. He's intelligent play from Frizzle, Frizzle to be doing. fair, but that's what he's doing. I've heard, I've, heard, I've heard the gaffer speaking to Howie about yeah. <laughs> challenges, making challenges. That is, you, you can see now he's yeah. <laughs> he's, <laughs> he's got the face. Yeah. Oh, I don't want to be a great coach right now. <laughs> 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 Good Just, it's not, it's uh, Agnew and Easton over at this time. Agnew whips it in with his left. Good well though by Alwa. Boyd's out, gets his foot there first and can he kickstart a counter attack? Brilliant Boyd. It's good from Stephen Boyd. Release it, there you yeah. go. He switch it out, yeah. Gilmore. It's alright. Skooks. Just calming it, calming it down a little bit. This, uh, Hutton goes long though. Good, Kev. Now we're back in, winning it. Not quite on the same page there. See, see what Hendel wanted, he just showed him the numbers. <laughs> see what he was looking for. How he's up well. Second ball falls in favour of the visitors though. Tenacious play though yeah. from Colley. We spoke about it in the first half as we Kev doing his. Oh, it's a little bit late there from Boyd. Advantage played by the ref. Smith. That's a poor, poor, poor cross and <laughs> a bit of frustration from the Audrey yeah. Boyd. But, um, <laughs> he had all the time in the world and it's shanked that one. And it starts to, you know, you start to become aware that you're still plenty of time to go obviously yeah. you start to become aware that you're running out of minutes you're two goals behind you start to try and force it pressure just starts building a wee bit that's again probably looking for Taggart once more yeah and it'll be Collie that's up though 
<laughs> like a strong header from for this. Smith just wants to flick up there. Again, good play for Boydie, just it's not there to be pushed about. Frizzle whips it in with his left. Wow. Good header. From good header. It's in a good area as well, and Henderson's flicked it on, but nearly, nearly right. come off. It's not one of his best. Let's relieve the pressure for Allo a little yeah. bit. Playing out there, and you're, it's oh, I I'll come back to that yeah, one. Touch that great is. touch from Henderson, finds it's himself a bit of space, puts it the back post to Boyd. Oh, right. oh. Set He's recovered it well, though, and he looks oh, okay. Yeah. okay. The, first, uh, the first touch wasn't the ideal, but yeah. brilliant for Hendo again. Great run for Kev as well because he's, he's occupying defenders, goes right to the heart of the goal. Yeah, just uh, the touch kind of went away from him. Boyd he recovered well and to yeah. get the shot away, but he's not really kind of placed. I think they're just looking for Senna to get out closer to the winger, but yeah. I, I, get, I haven't played there. And, you know, as, I think as a midfield, you're more worried about <laughs> what's in behind you, so you're worried about people getting by you and get to the byline. Um, but you do also need to get out and stop crosses. So. Good, good to set to Bayston and <laughs> Senna will chase that down for us. Well as well, but it. yeah, That's just deals with it. Well, you look to be too clever there on your no. weaker side. <laughs> Big hoof there yeah, from down there. He's trying to give that, wasn't he? Yeah, and it's a poor touch from four dice. He's recovered. Ah, he's recovered well, to be fair to him. Yep. <laughs> Just hit the top of his head. Yeah. <laughs> Mid his head. Yeah. And uh, did get the throw in in a decent area? It'd be disappointing. That's not. It's not a great header for that goal. But especially when the, you know this is this is what we're going to do for the rest of the game mm -hmm. now. Throwing comes in long. Salim wins it. Senna then gets it away and tag it. Just gets it out for a corner kick. It's pressure still on, though, for yeah, yeah. Easton over to take it in this near side. Steep once more. Headed back in. It's Senna that's got his head, and there's a bit of confusion between Senna and his goalkeeper. Yeah, just need to take a breath. Calms down a minute. Just trying to get out of this wee spell of pressure. Agnew to deliver. And it's a great save from David That's Hutton. Unbelievable save. That <laughs> is an unbelievable save because it's a great header yeah. as well. And he must be so disappointed to be, <laughs> is it Watson the now? Yeah. And not think you've got a goal to your name. It's a brilliant save for Hutts. Good, Vinny. Excellent. And he enjoyed it as oh. well, the fist bump afterwards. But great reactions. From David Hutton. Yeah, well done, Hutts. Yeah. That should be a free kick for Aloha. McKay ball over Henderson. Yeah, yeah. Time to just calm, that, calm the game down a bit yeah. after that. But <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, I think you can even see Watson now gesturing as if to say, how is that not went in? Because it's a really good header as well. He has, he's, he's got that in his locker. He is very acrobatic, David Hutton, to be fair to him. He's pulled off a couple of seasons yeah. like that this season. Yeah. There's such an important Get one at 2 0. Tag it over. Scott, knock it past. Easton, he's got time to drill yeah. across and Collies. How's that not going in? How's that not going in? That's <laughs> unbelievable. <laughs> <It's> a... <laughs> Brilliant for tags. You know, he, I think he looks at Easton and thinks yeah, you're, you're not a defender and he's having it all day. He does excellent. <laughs> I don't think it's, a, it's fired across it, Kev, to be fair. I just can't believe that's not ended up he's just He's just put it in the right yeah, direction. Yeah, and it's any touch will do. You would think. off the post. That's uh, one apiece there, to be fair. But the keeper's delighted that he's <laughs> ended up with his gloves, eh? I think so, no? 
Uh, brilliant for Tags. That's where you want Tags. That's that's him at his best. Game just sparked into life a little bit in the last Aye, five absolutely. minutes. Has indeed. Oh, there's that is Easton. Brandon deals with it at the front post though, and how he knocks it out for a throw in. Good play, good ball for. I think it was McCabe. So a nice turn back on his left foot for Watson as well, but well cleared. But again, we're, go I think we're going to see a few of these. Yeah. <coughs> Such an important spell in, in the game. This, yeah. Darkness out. Great, great header. He was a bit strong, right? Both back into the mix, but I guess between Gilmore and Dunn yeah, and Dilworth. Yeah, combi a combination. <laughs> Good touch on Boyd, he's got plenty of white shots. Hounded him down and he's <laughs> just... <laughs> <it behind. laughs> he's unlucky, he picks up an awkward ball there and just very quickly plowed it out. Yeah, he's just... Keeping up the pressure, it's Frizzle now. Cuts inside to his left. It's into a nice area to be fair, but yeah. It's a dangerous one because Hutch wasn't so confident to come and take it, and then you've got Tags aware there's a man behind them, but does well in the end. You're right in what you say though, there's a bit of tempo about it now. There's a bit of yeah, it's definitely kind of, like I say, sparked into life. Yeah. Which it's good for it's good for watching it, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> it spells in the first half that it was a wee bit a wee bit of a slower tempo, but it'd be nice to get a third goal and just give it a, a cushion because <laughs> tags. Nando's just taking a wee thump out of Gallica there, nothing given though, but it's ah, what a touch him. Just tag it, Henderson. Well done, yes. too. Well done. Turn out, turn out. Ah, well. Go the other side. Still go the other side. Spread it out, Howie. Ah, brilliant, Howie. What a ball Great that is. Great ball from Howie. Boyd's taking it down brilliantly. Oh, I'm not sure what bad one. No, un yeah, it's <laughs> <laughs> Somehow Alva still had possession. And here's Taggart. Scoogs at the edge. Great it's ball. It's a good ball from Taggart. And here's Taggart. Oh, ah, well done. Tags again. Great vision. It's a good bit of play there from Alva. A lot of intelligent playing. Yeah. But that, that was on target there from Skugel. Yeah, I think he's caught that well, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Be Skugel to go over and take I, can, I, I can only assume Boydy was looking for the overlap face. To say that. But listen, we'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> I have absolutely no idea what actually <laughs> happened. But uh, it's a decent ball in from Skugel. It's punched by Curry and... Easton will just hook that long. It's fine for Alwa. Yeah, that's it. So I'll be too much, of, too much of a hurry here, sorry. Let us get set back up again. Don't think Barry will be in any rush to make any substitutions. Do you see where we're uh, about 70, 70 yeah, minutes into and the game? Well, maybe not, but we have got good options, good experienced options yeah. on the bench as well, um, but no you're maybe right, um, it's not maybe a game that's crying out for a lot of changes at the minute, I can imagine you'll probably see more from Airdrie first, it's Skugel up against four dice, it's strong play again from Skugel, just uh, put that in a good area actually Kev, get us up the park, Kev goes back to his goalkeeper Henderson will chase him down, Curry to be fair, right, where he wanted it. Money. There you go, Senna, relax Senna's now. Senna's done well. Relax now, mate. And he's in a bit more of a familiar position. Yeah, well done, Boydie. Yeah, he's done well. I'm not sure if he meant it, but yeah. he's <laughs> done well <laughs> to find Boyd. Well done. Good play there from yeah, Alouas. Really well. Spreads it out to Taggart. He's got options in the box if he can pick them out. It's a good ball. Oh, good head as well. Kevin Colley was waiting for it, but... Well, by your jet. Oh, 
And here they come once more. Fordyce finds Easton, he's got uh, a pocket of space higher on that. He's just, I'd like us to be a bit higher on that, especially when they've got Haggy so deep. Good recovery for yeah, there, so no, actually well, well done. Looked like he maybe dived in a little bit yeah. too early, but he's recovered well. <laughs> it's amazing, I think you can hear something. Ah, sure. <laughs> <laughs> there's, some, there's some great shouts in Scottish lower <laughs> league football. <laughs> But again, it's just that familiar, familiar scene, long throw in from Airdrie. Yeah. Right into the heart of the box. Good throw from Senna. Agnew's just read that from yeah. Boyd. Again, Easton's got plenty of space. Oh, he's gone he down. Might, oh. Yeah, he looked like he went down really easily he's, there. He's, I think he's looking for it. Um, yeah. It's just such a scary one. Once you're wrong side. Yeah. Once you're wrong side, it's... Good referee, and he's got he's, he's made his decision very quickly there. And you've got he's, he's got to go to the book if he's if yeah he's thought he died because like you say it is. Now, right? I think I think we've got four maybe they must have a few yeah. There's been a one or two that have been subbed off, but uh, they're fairly racking them up. Just the one for our what? Changed days from I've just what, a, a month ago. <laughs> Taggart's come to take that one deep. He's a good ball yeah, as well. He's done well Great to find on Skugel. It. He's got McEnroy oh, up against him. <sighs> Should keep possession though. Well done, so. Howie. And Senna. Step in. Gilmore. Henderson forced back, but just, just keeps possession. Yeah, yeah. Senna's so get, so getting booed for that challenge for uh, the dive, whatever you want to call it. Early. Coley back into Taggart. Familiar right side we've seen since I've been here, Tags and, Tags and Kev. It's good to watch. Good to watch it. They've played for so long together, they must just be such like in, in intelligent players like that, they're just always in the same wavelength to know exactly what each other the type of passes they'd want and yeah. where they're gonna be and whatnot. Hutton goes long. No challenge there on four dice, but Senna picks up the lowest ball and Henderson brings it down well. <laughs> well done, yeah. Good feet from Senna. Gilmore gets a four to ah, Henderson. Brilliant handle. Yeah, brilliant great handle. turn. He's got Taggart with tags. acres of space on his right hand hit side. That. Just hit he that brings it. Oh. And he has hit it and it's right over the bar. Great timing yeah. and everything there. Hendo's touch forward instantly. He just sets that right up. And Kev delays, delays, sucks the defender in. The tags will be disappointed with that, with his technique and ability. It's a good opportunity, but well worked. Finale, like you say, absolutely. Very, very quick thinking for Hendo. That's great feet again from Gilmore. On the turn. And Henderson's up there alone, but he'll back himself. Oh, very well. Boyd's done well. And then they get it out Good to Taggart again. Absolutely perfect. Yeah. And now he's got it's exactly the position he wants it in. Come on, bad uh, ball. Uh, just doesn't come down enough, like you oh. said. And Al will be making the first substitution of the afternoon. Not a bad man to bring on. Not at all. Alan Trouton will come on as well. One of the, one of the best. Yeah, <laughs> one of the best, absolutely. <laughs> Scored on Wednesday night. Typical, typical trout yeah, Just absolutely. don't panic. Don't panic in front of the goal. He'll come on for Stephen Boyd, putting a shift on that left-hand side. Yeah, I think... I, I think Boyd is want to get in, definitely wants to get in amongst the goals. Um, like I say, I think his header for Hendo's second is one of those moments in the game that probably wouldn't get spoken about, but it's a, exactly. it's a brilliant header. Um, and he's, again, he's putting a shift that he always puts in. So. He's had 
He's played well today. Don't know how long he's left it. Just, just less than 15 minutes. Yeah. Yeah. 15 or so minutes. Definitely good to get Trouch back in and about it as well, though, like after he's. A bit like myself, kind of been nursing a, an injury that's just yeah. kind of kept. The cutting. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Nah, he doesn't need to do that, Mendy. He just puts his arm up and knocks the air just attacker down, and they've got a free kick right on the edge of the box. It's just it's a, it's a silly one, isn't it? It's, it it's so it obvious. <laughs> it is. it's, it's the only part of Nando's game I just think he needs to brush up on. It's just it's silly. I think he's got the basic attributes that you would want in any centre half. He's even quick over the ground, but just he's very eager at times to go and. Yeah. Win headers and do things like that. A couple in the first half, you know, he's run under one of the headers. Yeah. It's, it's just a bit excitable at times, isn't it? Yeah. That's probably maybe a good word to describe it. Um, and with the technicians, Airdrie, I've got here at their disposal, yeah. it's, I think it's wrong, it's, it's a hard one, it's right on the edge of the box, but I think it's McCabe's probably the favourite out of those ones. He looks like the one that's lining it up. Yeah, I think he'd be claiming a shot. Maybe Salim just to drive it, and he does, and it's it's a strong we goal. Kev, <laughs> yeah. Off we Kev's hip, I think. And Hutton certainly yeah. enjoyed that one. You can see a little bit of his <laughs> crazy side when he's. <laughs> I think a bam. I think a bam. Is that, the best that's way the way to it. A good bam, but a bam. <laughs> it's a good bam. That's what I'll go with. Again, Colley just throwing himself in front of everything this half. McKay Bofat from centre half to throw in another long throw. Yeah. Looking for a lifeline. I'm going to stop team. now. No. No, I'm going to stop now with 10 minutes to go. Just, yes. Gilmore gets it. Clear, but it's Gilmore is going to get another crack at the whip. Dropped into a nice area, targets out, headers out, 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 out. to Smith. Howie's Brilliant, Howie. Yeah. Brilliant, Howie. Howie's done well to yeah. block that one out for a corner kick. He did dive in as well. It's a good ball in from Agnew. Oh, it's come all the way through. Knocked back Ooh, into the box this time. Though. Mendy is away. Still there though. Salim fancies it. And it's safe into the hands of David Hutton. Danger averted. And that's what you want, Fernando. That's yeah. what he can do. You know, he's up above everybody there. Big, powerful header. I think Hutch might have got away with one there. He had it in his hands. I don't what, know if you can do that's, that. That's what I was thinking as well. He dropped it and then yeah. he picked it off again. <laughs> <laughs> we won't say anything. <laughs> Gallagher takes it down in his chest. He's done well, Gallagher. Now Smith driving into the box. Left foot puts it into a dangerous area, and nobody knows where that one's going from Mendy, but thankfully it's safe into the hands of Hutton. Just gets his, his big toe on that one. Yeah. <laughs> you just don't know where that's spinning away to. He's <laughs> going to go pass back because you can pick it up as well. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Get the wee man. Ah, it's, ah, it's so close there. McEnroy does just about do enough to get that one away. Salim's done well. It's a decent ball in from Allen, but nobody there. It's quite a classic Google touch, that isn't it? Just to take it down and the side and yeah, the outside of his left. Looking foot. to take it forward as yeah. well. Okay, he didn't quite break his way, knocking it round him. It's forward, Henderson. It's put for a dice, just good. good. It's good though from Alloa, confident play. Just a little bit too tight in there, and Airdrie break. 
Smith looking forward to Allen. Good strong play there from Mendy. <laughs> Looked like he could have maybe gone down there, but I think what, he crept into the box for a second yeah. as well, just running at that angle. He does back himself, Mendy, in most foot races. You can see him like he does yeah. like to take the extra yard and back himself to recover. Again, another another attribute he's got in his locker. He's he's quick off the ground and for a guy that size. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> well, feel at times he just needs to take a not relax, but just take a breath. Yeah. And not be so eager to go and win it. Um, Except the ones you can't win, basically. And I'm sure someone like Vernon will be quick in his ear all the time. He seems <laughs> like a like a noisy customer to play alongside. Yeah. In a good way, in a good way. But it's just always barking out orders. Bark, barking, barking is a good word to describe <laughs> that as well. I like that. <laughs> as Dunning, as clearance just goes high. As the lane comes teaming down. Gallagher just adds to it, makes it even better. Yeah. Sucks the pitch up again. And that's what you want when you're playing on this. See it out. It's fine. Yeah. Out for the kick. Again, <laughs> again, Senna's getting a bit of stick for the manager. <laughs> a bit harsh. <laughs> I don't actually know what that one was for. I mean, he's done. It's just, he's he's just done yeah. I, I feel the same when I'm playing. You, you, it's very hard to go and in, in, influence the game the way you maybe want to, but you, you do your job. That's kind of what I feel like I'm in there to do sometimes when I'm playing left back. And yeah. I'd, I'd imagine saying I'll be similar. They're, they're trying to do a job for the team as best you can. Is that a position you enjoy playing left back? As um, I mean, I obviously much prefer a right back because yeah. it's, it's more natural. Um, just <laughs> not. I want to be like, yeah, just happy to play, happy to play anywhere. Yeah. It's a, it is a challenge. It is a challenge to play that side because you didn't realise how awkward it is to defend on that side until you do it. Yeah. For for the full game, obviously in the middle you're you're just kind of here and everywhere. The middle is, I think, my most natural and best position, and it is where I want to play. Mm -hmm. um, Again this season, I found myself kind of, which is which is it doesn't which doesn't bother me obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm happy to do it. More than happy to do it. Scribble over this corner kick. It would be a nice time to just you take the words out of my mouth. Put this game to bed. <laughs> words right out of my mouth as I saw Vinny jogging up the park. And it is. <laughs> <Darn it. laughs> So close, he's headed it wide. He's yeah. probably he's probably going to be frustrated himself. A with wee that bit, one. I would say. Yeah. yeah, he is under pressure. It's not a free header, but again, I think over the course of the season, I would be looking at Nando and Vinny to be to be an option a few. Especially when Alou, I've had, they've always known. I've sent Andy Graham's always been one yeah. that's had a decent decent Absolutely. goal tally. So it's head of the park that we do like to get goals from normally. Yeah, Aye, Andy's always been good at chipping in, chipping in with a few. He's just, just clever, yeah. he's just so clever in those areas, in his movement. I mean, it's fairly it's coming high, down. Yeah, isn't it, huh? Ball comes into the area. Oh, Mendy just doesn't quite deal with that. Alan latches onto it, it's a cross Good goal. Good well done. Intelligent play there from Taggart, but heart and mouth moment there from yeah. Mendy. And it's good from Easton, he gets it back into there, and that's better from Mendy. Taggart makes sure it's a nice corner kick. He's got a free, I, I was I was complimenting him, but he's got a free header, he's probably got to do. I think yeah, I think he'll think, I think he'll think that as well. That header's got, yeah. got to come it's all the towards line. us. That however is a great header. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Easton into the box now, dancing feet, it's Google standing him up though. Henderson forces him back, it's Agnew, whips in with his Good left, tag it's away, McCabe, there's Frizzle, good from Dunning, and Troughton will just, oh, gives it right to for Dice, and that's in the bottom corner, and that's a goal out of nothing, Allo will be 
kicking themselves with that one. And it's just trickled into the bottom corner from the Urge skipper. Yeah, I wonder if that's take, that taken a nick off it. Yeah, it must have. The, the way it's went in, the way Hutton's just rooted, yeah. rooted to the spot, the way Hutton's is set. And don't need to say too much about it. Obviously, Trout's will be disappointed there. Yeah. Um, usually the part of his game that we all love, where he's calm on the ball, calm in front of the goal. Yeah. There's maybe an occasion just to lace his through it. And it's going to make for an interesting last five minutes. Yeah. 85 minutes on the clock. Alloa 2, Airdrie 1. There's a build-up of pressure, a build-up of mistakes there, yeah, actually. Yeah, um, poor clearances. Um, which allowed them to get corners into the box, crosses into the box. That's what's probably most disappointing about that, taking away, you know, the, the final part of it. Yeah, um, it's not just one mistake. No, it's, not it's, at all. So that's it's, been it's a build-up of... Yeah. Single them out. It's been a build-up of some errors there. Frizzle knocks it into an area. Nando commits, but I'll oh, we'll get away with it. Scoogle just hooks yeah. that clear. Yeah, anywhere will do, to be honest. And from looking, you know, fairly comfortable, all of a sudden you look like you're kind of hanging on. We need to get out. Yeah. Easton's going to put that. Oh, he's knocked it back to his skipper. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Mickey clips that over to McEnroy. He's done well, just drops it into Easton. Well done, Good Howie. Excellent. Howie. Relax now. Yeah. Can we get a recounter attack? Get across him. Oh, oh we'll take it. Turn, and it's turn, trickled turn. through, and here's Henderson. Oh, he's been hooked down. It's a no. good challenge. Oh, I think he, he got did the ball. Get the ball. Uh, it's a very good tackle. But it certainly looked like he got a part of it. And now the pressure's on. Henderson still down. Airdrie come forward. Corner kick for Airdrie, and it's turning into a little bit of a basketball game. Yeah. <laughs> Which is exactly what I, I don't want it to win. I, I don't think I'm wrong. I, I, it's, a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a very aggressive tackle for the game. I think he did get enough of the ball there. And it's sparked a, straight onto the counter as well. So. But he is fine. He is fine, Henderson. He's popping yeah. back in to cover. Okay, ball comes in for the box. Good trout. Yeah, it's away. Can tag it, get out there. Ace McKay puts it back into there. That's well really done. Well. Yes. Good decision as well. Well done. And I will just take their time with that. Hopefully just... Brilliant down here initially for Howie on the first yeah. one as well. He's just won the foul as well, but driving up the line. Probably not the most favourite part of his game there. Yeah. <laughs> driving away for defenders, but... But he's done well. Yeah, he's released it well. and Got the ball through to, to Trouts and Hendo. And it will be the big Irishman to come on in the final kind of couple of minutes of this game, Connor Salmon. It's probably to be expected, the way the, the game's gone, to yeah. get big Samuel yeah, on. Yeah, well, I suppose Hendo's he's on a hat trick maybe but I'd imagine it'll be for Hendo I don't think anybody knows I think it is Henderson I don't think he knows though actually so goes off great shift from Ewan Henderson this afternoon yeah he'll be very happy with his and he should be he should be a couple of goals to his name to be fair that is how slow Hendo moves when he's not <laughs> he, he's unbelievably fast but yeah. when he's <laughs> everyone else <laughs> he's so chilled out <laughs> So chilled out, just sauntering off. But not two goals to his name today. Yep, takes his, um, takes his tally up to five for the season, which is uh, good return. Four and two as well, four yeah. and two games back to back. That's going to help all sorts of confidence levels. Excellent. That's what you want. You want your strikers scoring goals. Be fair to Samuel when he's had coming off the bench, he's had opportunities. Yeah, he's he's scored a few goals, a few big goals as well. And it's a brilliant header from Connor Salmon. And he's put through oh. Trouton, and he probably had a little bit more time than he thought. Yeah, could, he maybe could have taken a touch, but... That's a great header there from Salmon. Lovely, yeah, lovely flick. And Alawa, can they get the second ball? They can, and it's just... Ball comes back into the box. Nando jumps early, but it's into the hands of the goalkeeper. Done Hutch again. But yeah, Salmon scored a, a cracking goal a, a, against the Adrian this he season. Did, he was, did, he absolutely did. I yeah. didn't know he had that in his locker, but it was a, it was a oh, tidy was finish on the very, turn. Very, very good finish indeed. And he's, a couple of times he's had to come off the bench, and uh, Falkirk as well. Yeah, good yeah. yeah, absolutely. Great big guy as well. Mm. Got a lot of time for him. The level he's played at. Um, sometimes you don't know what you're getting for people like yeah. that, but great attitude. 
straight, straight around the chest of him. And he's going to chase that one right down. And I, I wouldn't have fancied being Reese at this point. Yeah, he's done well. Yep. <laughs> so strong there from Salmon. Yeah. And surely. Just take up the line with you, big man. Uh, no foul given. Yeah. And he's unlucky there. He's done everything right, to be fair to him. Agnew goes forward. Mendy deals with it. Get a touch. Scoogle oh, just hooks right. it out. Uh, he probably, like you say, probably could have taken a touch and... I can see what he's thinking, but I we know what's coming now. Yeah, um, one last throw as we he maybe, uh, listen, enter stoppage time. Yeah, he maybe needs, needs to be told as well. It's a big moment for Alwa. Everyone's back. Salmon's back in the, yeah. the heart of the another box. reason. To another reason to bring him on. Exactly. You know, because I always said these can be more dangerous in a corner sometimes because you can be very accurate with this. Decided to take it short, and that's poor well from Easton. Drive, to be drive. And this is exactly what Scott Taggart likes. He's got Trout in there as well. He's got Scoogle on his right. He's uh, waited, he's slipped through Trout in, and it's just a wee bit missed, but it's still there for Alan. Settle down then, we're fine yeah. now. Intelligent, experienced play there from Colin Trout in. Yeah, I was going to say, I absolutely love for Trout's to bag a third. Yeah, it's good though from Gilmore well and Settle there. Take it well back done, in. Charlie. That's brilliant. By the fill, and that's exactly that's what you want. Top class. Well done. Yeah. yeah maybe if the, if the ball was a little bit to, more towards Trout's feet, maybe could have taken it in a touch. Yeah, and one on one. That's, that's that's what he's tried to do. It's the tags, I think he's just also hit it on the surface. But uh, but it's fine. We've I got a free kick in the corner. Oh, no, definitely. That's absolutely. Definitely. Would have been delighted to see Trout's roll the ball in the net as we're just given given the way the goal came about as well for yeah for Airdrie but brilliant work for Tags <laughs> and now we'll just keep that ball in the corner flag and we'll be absolutely fine with it there no reason not to <laughs> <laughs> Gilmore just hooks it back <laughs> in there <laughs> to the second uh, minute of additional time. I think, we, I think we could say it's been, it's been fairly professional from us. Uh, yeah. Bar that build up to that goal, but the, the build up to the Airdrie goal, sorry. It's been a fairly professional second half performance, if you like, with the lead. Still there, probably one more opportunity in this for Airdrie. Smith gets the ball to the box, how he slipped, and it's into the hands That's of David right. Hutton, and you'd probably reckon that, that might be their last opportunity of the game. Yeah, that's will take his time. It's a good header, it was the boy Salim again. Yeah. He's, he's won a few headers since he came on. He's got good in the air, to be fair. But he's got a lot to do there to score that one. David Hutton will just put that right onto the, the big man's head. He's done good strength and tried to knock it into the corner. As referee, we continue to play. Th yeah. Three minutes into the game now. Big header, Vinny. Yeah, well done. Darnan deals with it. And Salmon, good strength from Salmon, but Agnew's done yeah, well. Yeah, it's brilliant. Barry Cook, both of full there. time. And Aloha get, get the three points. It's two wins in a row. It's a double from Ewan Henderson. There's a little bit of a scare in the last five minutes when four dice brought them back into it. But like you said, John professional performance from Alo and it's another three points absolutely <laughs> massive as well I said it before the game yeah, on the back of last week you've got to try and make last week count by following it up Airdrie are in form we said that as well so that's a massive massive three points to get a game against a good side um, and like, a little scare at the end yeah. I'll maybe go and slag trips for it now <laughs> now that we've got the three points but uh, no, delighted with that delighted with that brilliant for Hendo another double let's see you want your striker scoring goals yeah Plenty of positives. You can look at the likes of Collie yeah. and Howie as well. They've, all, they've all had good games. Brilliant. I'm looking at Senna. Yeah. You know, he's done nothing. He's maybe going to come off there thinking, I've not done much today, but he's done his job. Yeah. Done nothing wrong. It's, it's difficult difficult to get put out in that position. I know myself, so. No. And it's very well done. It's momentum builds for Alo as they travel to Falkirk next Saturday, which will no doubt be a, a, another tricky tie. <laughs> they, they, they just keep coming, don't they? They just keep coming, but. When you're in form and you start to get a wee, a wee rhythm going, you know, it doesn't matter. Bring on anyone. Yeah, and exactly. it'll be a tough place to go. We obviously had, we had a tough game against them. I know it, it looked like a good result and a convincing result, but it was a tough game. 
um, they move the ball well. Yeah. They've got people in the middle of the park that are you know, good with walking their feet and want to get on it. So that will be a new test. But we can now look forward to that on the back end of the last Two couple ends, of weeks. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Exactly. Well, thank you very much for joining me on oh, to John. You've been, pleasure. You've been an, an expert. <laughs> pleasure. And I, w I mean, I would like to say I would love to do it again, but I want to I be down there with yeah, the boys as well. Hopefully, so. hopefully you're <laughs> back in up against your old pal Stevie Hetherington next week. That would well, be that interesting. Was it. Last time I was at left back as well, yeah, get, up against Stevie. Get, right. get you toe yeah. to toe with him in the middle of the park. It'd be interesting. I need to watch out for some of the some of the Stevie, the famous Stevie tackles that we've seen over the exactly. over the years. I'm sure the likes of Senna and Gilmore will enjoy <laughs> playing against them if they're <laughs> given the nod as well. But absolutely, uh, definitely. No, it's been a pleasure, and hopefully, hopefully you'll be back next week. Uh, that's that's what I'm. I'm I'm hoping for as well, confident with that. Yeah. Right, thank you very much Cheers, for watching. Thanks thank for you. joining me and see you later. Cheers now.